Hello everyone, I hope everybody are well. Today we will solve this math Olympiad question. How to solve this radical math question? So it is a Japanese math Olympiad question and we will solve this question without calculator. This question is square root 11 power 4 plus 100 power 4 plus 111 power 4 over 2. So we have solved this question without calculator. So how to solve this radical math question? So first of all, I can say easily it will be square root look 11 power 4 and here is 100 power 4 and here is 111. I can say it will be easily 11 plus 100 and whole to the power 4 over 2 these two now look this is 11 this is 100 this is 11 this is 100 so we'll let look let x is equal to 11 and y is equal to 100 then i can see easily it will be square root look 11 power 4 so I can see easily it will be x to the power 4 because of that we will let x is equal to 11 so I can see easily it will be x to the power 4 plus y to the power 4 plus look I can see it will be x plus y and whole to the power 4 over 2 then what can I do I can see easily it will be square root look and here is x to the power 4 so i can see it will be x to the power 4 plus y to the power 4 but in this case i can say this exponent is 4 so it will be x plus y whole square and whole to the power 2 we you know that 2 times 2 it will be 4 according to exponential rules then over 2 then i can say easily it will be square root and here is x to the power 4 plus y to the power 4 plus and in this case look if you think it is a it is b so i can say a plus b whole square it will be a square plus 2ab plus b square so according to these rules i can see it will be x square plus y square plus 2xy and whole to the power 2 this 2 over 2 this 2 okay now what can i do so in this case i can see it will be square root and here is over 2 and you know that the formula look a plus b plus c whole square it will be a square plus b square plus c square plus 2ab plus 2bc plus 2ca according to this source i can see easily here is if you think it is a it is b it is c so i can say a plus b plus c whole square it will it will be a square plus b square plus c square plus 2ab 2bc 2ca so i can say here is here is x to the power 4 there is no change and here is y to the power 4 but in this case a is square so a is x square so i can say x square and whole square plus b square b is y square so y square whole square plus c c it will be 2xy so 2xy and power is 2 and in this case i can say 2ab a is x square and b is y square so i can see it easily it will be 2x square and y square plus 2bc so 2 and in this case b is y square and c is 2xy plus and in this case i can see easily uh, 2ca so 2 uh, this formula is 2 and this 2 it will be 4 and this x times this x it will be x to the power 3 and this y so 4 x to the power 3 y then this equation becomes square root this 2 and in this case i can say here is x to the power 4 plus y to the power 4 
plus and in this case i can see it will be x to the power 4 because of that 2 times 2 it will be 4 and here is y to the power 4 plus and in this case i can see it will be 4 x square y square because of that here is 2 to the power 2 it will be 4 and in this case i can see it will be 2 x square y square plus 2 times 2 it will be 4 and here is x and y times y square it will be y to the power 3 and here is 4x to the power 3y now what can i do i can see easily it will be square root look i can see easily it will be square root and here is 2 and x to the power 4 plus x to the power 4 it will be 2x to the power 4 and y to the power 4 plus y to the power 4 i can see it will be 2y to the power 4 so i can see easily it will be x 2x to the power 4 plus 2y to the power 4 plus and in this case i can see easily 4x square y square and here is 2x square y square so it will be 6x square y square and in this case it will be 4x y to the power 3 plus 4x to the power 3y now look every value are divided by 2 so if i divide by 2 this time i can see it will be square root look square root it will be x to the power 4 plus y to the power 4 this 6 divide 2 it will be 3 x square y square plus 4 divide 2 it will be 2 x y to the power 3 plus 2 4 divide 2 it will be 2 x to the power 3 y then i can see it will be square root look now i can see easily, easily it will be x square plus whole square look 2 times 2 it will be 4 and here is y square whole square 2 times 2 it will be 4 and here is 3x square y square so i can see it will be x y whole square plus 2x square y square look here is 2x square y square and here is x square y square so if i add we'll find out here is 3x square y square and here is 2x y to the power 3 plus 2x to the power 3y look in this case i can say easily it will be square root look if you think it is a it is b it is c so i can say a square plus b square plus c square plus 2ab plus 2bc plus 2ca according to these rules i can say here is a is x square plus b is y square plus c is x y whole square so square root is cancelled we will find out here is x square plus y square plus 2xy then we remember that we are at x is equal to 11 and y is equal to 100 so in this case i can see easily it will be 11 square because of that we are know that x is equal to 11 so 11 square it will be 1 to 1 and y square y is 100 so it will be 10,000 and here is x y so 100 times 11 it will be 1100 now if i add we'll find out our final answer is look this is 0 0 1 it will be 1 0 0 2 it will be 2 1 0 1 it will be 2 and 1 0 it will be 1 and here is 1 so this is our final answer in this Japanese math Olympiad question. We solve this question without calculator. So if you enjoyed this video, please subscribe my channel and like this video for others interesting video. Thank you all. Thanks for watching. Goodbye. Take care.